given that log to base 10 of x is equal to bar 1.3010 and log to base 10 of y is equal to 1.6021 find log to base 10 of root of x over y so we know that the root of x over y can be rewritten as 1 over 2 so we apply the law that if we have a number to an exponent, the exponent comes to multiply to give us this. Then we apply the law of logarithm again that if the numbers are dividing, then we we'll share the base for them and subtract. Now we reach here, so the next thing we do is to substitute these values log 10 x equal this and log 10 y equal this so this will be equal to 1 over 2 1 over 2 then we have bar 1.30 bar 1 1.3010 then minus 1.60 one. So we know the mantisa, the mantisa, and the characteristics. So in logarithm, we deal with them separately. So we need to separate them. So one over two into bracket by one. That is the first characteristic. Then plus three point plus zero point zero point. 3010 that is the first one teaser then minus 1 minus 1 minus 0 0.6021 we know the one teaser can never be negative but we'll see what will happen now we group them so we have we have bar 1, bar 1 will give us bar 2. So 1 over 2 into 1 over 2 into bar 2. Then, so this and this will give us bar 2. Then we have this and this will give us 0 0.30. So minus zero point three zero one one. Uh, as we said, this can never be negative because it is the mantisa. So we need to find a way out. So what we do is that we add an integer. An integer such that if we divide we add and subtract an integer that will make this positive but uh, that integer should be such that after adding this thing will remain an integer so the least integer that we can add to this and get a positive number that is a positive mantisa and when we divide this by 2 we we'll get an integer is 2 so we have this will be equal to this will be equal to 1 over 2 1 over 2 into by 2 1 over 2 into by 2 then minus 2 minus 2 plus 2 so this minus 2 plus 2 is 0 so it has not changed this then we have minus 0 0.3011 so this will be equal to now this is bar 2 bar 2 I told you that bar 2 is the same as negative 2 so the two of them will give us bar 4 so we have bar 4 bar 4 which is the same as negative 4 then 2 minus 0 0.3011 will give us 
1.6989 so plus 1.6989 1.6989 so what we do next is to divide this so we divide by 4 by 2 we get by 2 we get by 2 then we divide 1.6989 by 2 we get 0 0.0.84895 0 .84 now we can rewrite this as by 2 by 2.8495 now let's look at the B aspect a man bought some shirts for 720 Ghana cities if each shirt was two cities cheaper he would have received four more shirts calculate the number of shirts bought so let's say the number of shirts is n so let n be the number of shirts Now, if n is the number of shirts, then the price of each shirt, that is the cost of each shirt, the cost of each shirt will be equal to the total, which is 720 divided by n. Now, we were told that if the shirt if the shirts were two CDs cheaper, so if the shirts were two CDs cheaper, he would have then, then the cost, then the cost of each shirt will be 720 over n minus two CDs. And if you simplify this further, we get 72n minus 2n over n. Now, the number of shared bought now, so the new number of shared bought now will increase by 4. So we have n plus 4. Now we need to find the total cost. So we multiply this by the unit price. So the total cost will be equal to the number bought. So this is the variable one, the variable total cost will be equal to the number bought which is n plus 4 times the cost of each which is 720 minus 2n over n and it's supposed to be equal to 720 Ghana cities. So we cross multiply so we get n plus 4 into 720 minus 2n is equal to 720n. Now let's expand to obtain 720n minus 2n squared, then plus, plus 2880, then minus 8n is equal to 720n. Now this cancels this, so we have negative 2n squared, we have negative 2n squared minus 8n plus 2880 is equal to zero so we can multiply through by negative one to obtain something like this now when we factor this we obtain this n plus 40 into n minus 36 equals zero so n is either equal to negative 40 or positive 36 so this can only be the number of shared boards and the number of shared boards is 36